really sums up the type of competitor that Dominique is. You know, she's hurting tonight, no question about that. Wrist injuries, ankle injuries, but she did not water down her tumbling moves whatsoever. That's really the type of champion that she is. Still very explosive in her tumbling runs. This, of course, being her trademark. Double twist rebounds right back to her second tumbling run. Very explosive. You wouldn't even know that she was injured. Really the first gymnast to do combination tumbling run like that. So Dominique with a 9.80 on the floor exercise, and that will move her up from that sixth place after the compulsories. Here's J.C. Phelps, who lives in Cincinnati, teammate of Amanda Bordens, who is missing the competition with a foot injury tonight. You know, J.C. had the strongest rookie performance I've ever seen at a World Championships last year in Dortmund. Did a great job. Tim, a bit of a rough year since the Dortmund World Championships, but has really bounced back in the last month. Won the U.S. Classic heading into these national championships. Is fantastic on this event. Got a beautiful line. Really nice toes, extended body. Everybody's doing this dismount in Cincinnati. Double front and a great landing. Big smile for J.C. Phelps and her coach, Mary Lee Tracy. Now the butterflies are out. All right, all right, no more nervous stuff, okay? So J.C. Phelps Go looking to uh, make you a reputation like here at the Nationals with a 9.85 on the uneven bars. Here's Dominic Moshianu with her second vault. That's a good one! Well, you heard Bella. That's a good one. The second one definitely will be the score that carries on. Far more explosive and a better landing. Best vault counts here at these championships. That was a big one. As Bella said, it was a big one. Everything about the vault was better. She had a little bit more speed down the runway, came into the horse, a little better angle, got a better bounce because of it, a little higher in the air. But this is the most important thing, the landing way better, just that small little hop forward. And a big smile already. And by the way, if you think she'll be intimidated at this uh, all-around competition, uh-uh, 9.9 .9 on that second ball. She's been doing it for so long, being Shannon Miller, the gymnast, the champion, the girl from Oklahoma. She is the most decorated gymnast, man or woman, America has ever known. Yet tonight she has to answer the question that the entire gymnastics world is asking. Are her best days behind her? It's such an incredible feat. She's a great champion, but to live up to those past performances, it's going to be hard. And this will be a tough test, Tim. Many would prefer to hide the balance beam, but to open the competition on this event, this is a big test. Current world champion here, though. Very nice. Nice to cut. She has certainly grown from the little girl that was second all round in Barcelona. Already just a slight balance break on a very new skill for Shannon. Good girl, all right. Good fight. Set her set, setting up now for her tumbling Good element up. in combination. Four skills in a row. Two layouts and a third. Wow. That is, that is a disaster right now. there. Fall off the beam, five-tenths of a point. Automatic deduction. Had a girl, nice one. Beautiful. Steve Nuno, her coach in the background. 
The world is just a little bit out of control, I'm sure. In both up. of these people's Bring it up heads. Call. This dismount's been giving Shannon a lot of problems in the training. Just the landing, hey. Hey, perfectly girl. done. All right, how to fight it. Okay. How to fight it, baby. Well, she right. did recover her composure fight. enough to stick the landing, but look at uh, her face. She knows that that might have been the, the competition fight. with right. that one fall. Four elements, starting with a back handspring into three layouts. You can imagine the shoulders and hips have to be absolutely in line with the beam. She totally missed the right foot. Absolutely no chance of holding on to that skill. Only 9.375 on the balance beam, and that will take Shannon Miller out of first place. Mociano, the new leader, Phelps second, Miller all the way down to third. Dominique Dawes has moved up a spot to number five. 